2014 Chevron Game Day Chef Grand Champion. Can you imagine what it would be like on January 1st to win $25,000 to start your year off? I never in a million years thought that I would have won it, but I did last year and you can win this year because Chevron is back with the second annual Game Day Chef Challenge. All you got to do is go to the website at www.thegamedayshelf.com and check it out. And Chevron's asked me to share with you my winning tips and strategies to help you be the grand champion this year. So let's get to it. Let's start with rule number one or tip number one, which is follow the rules. Every game has its own set of rules. And you don't want to be penalized before you even start the game. So check out that website, check out the rules, and make sure you follow them to a T. But I want to point out one rule in particular, which is going to take us to my tip number two, maximize your points. You get up to 25 points for using Chevron ingredients. For every ingredient you use, you get five points up to five ingredients. So why would you use just one or two or three or even four ingredients? Don't leave any points on the table. No professional athlete would ever do that. Use your five ingredients, maximize your points because your competitors will be doing exactly that. But here's the good news. When you walk into your Chevron store, you are gonna be amazed at the array of ingredients that you have available to you. It is crazy, which takes us to point number three, be creative. I spent literally hours in my local Chevron last year letting the ingredients speak to me. And the craziest of things jumped out to me. I used root beer, dried apricots, cashews, bacon, yogurt, and sesame candy. Would you ever think those would come together in a recipe? But they did in my cashew crusted fried chicken sliders with a root beer, bacon, apricot, sesame jam with yogurt chipotle sauce on a toasted brioche bun with fresh basil. There is a recipe using actually six Chevron ingredients. I threw an extra one in there for good measure. So don't Limit yourself to what you can use. There are great ingredients that can come together to make a wonderfully creative dish. Number four, make sure it looks good. In the preliminary rounds, nobody's gonna get to taste your food. It has to look delicious. You want somebody to look at that picture and go, nom, 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 I wanna eat that right up. Make it look good, check your lighting, make it appetizing, get a good angle on it. Make it look like something you wanna eat and that the judges wanna eat. So that takes us through number four. Let's move on to tip number five. What is this challenge called? It's called the Game Day Chef Challenge. Make it game day food. Don't make it something that's gonna melt all over the place or you can't pick up with one hand. Somebody's gotta be able to eat at a tailgating party and cheer their team on with the other hand. Game Day Chef Challenge. Make a great game day dish. And finally, tip number six, taste. It's all about the taste once you get to the cook-offs. You wouldn't be entering if you didn't want to make it to the cook-off, and at the cook-offs, taste is 50% of your score. It doesn't matter how great it looked on paper, or how creative or beautiful it was if it doesn't actually taste good. You want to be the dish that the judges circle back around and they're like, can I have another bite of that? Because, whoa, that was good. That's how delicious you want your dish to be. So you want to follow these six tips and strategies so you can take my place as the Chevron Game Day Chef Grand Champion. So go to your Chevron store, grab some ingredients, cook up your best game day chef, snap a picture of it, send it into Chevron, and I'll see you at game day. Stay tuned for my winning recipe from last year, in addition to a couple of inspirational recipes to get your juices flowing for this year's contest. What are you waiting for? Go to the website now, www.thegamedayshef.com, and get your winning recipe in. See you at game day.